Talk about the art of the deal. A New York City woman believes she may have scored two Banksy artworks for just $120 after coming across a mysterious art sale inside a subway station. Colleen Alexander, 26, took to TikTok last week to share a video explaining how she bought the works that could have been created by the elusive British graffiti artist. I just can't stop shaking at the chance that this may be real, Alexander exclaimed at the beginning of her 3 minute TikTok video, which has now been viewed more than 6.6 million times. The New Yorker said she was at the 14th Street and 8th Avenue station on her way home from work when she noticed Banksy style artworks scattered on the subway stop floor it had back quote cash or bitcoin only, this is not a photo opportunity signs, and there was no one there. The paintings were just there, she stated. Alexander decided to step onto the train and travel home to her apartment on the east side of Manhattan, but couldn't stop thinking about the artworks she had just seen. Something in me was like back quote go back, so I literally got off my train, stopped at the first ATM I could find, and went back to the west side. I was just praying that it, the art sale, would still be there, she excitedly explained. Sure enough, Alexander found the artworks were still in place. However, there was now a mysterious man in a ski mask who was surveying the scene. I looked around and somebody gave a slight nod, and I saw this guy standing, full face covered. I asked, back quote are you selling those, and he just nodded, he would not speak, Alexander explained. She allegedly paid him $120 for two of the artworks, before rushing home to film her TikTok video. The young art enthusiast was left so excited by her purchases that she ended her clip by claiming she didn't even care if they were not authentic Banksy pieces. Maybe I'm going to sound like an absolute idiot, but honestly, the value of this art, the way it's making me feel right now, it might as well be a Banksy, she said. This excitement and this hope, even if it's not Banksy, all I want to say is thank you to whoever set this up. Thank you. The Post has reached out to Banks's publicist for comment about the artwork's authenticity.